I'm here to talk about the character trait of the month, which is responsibility. Responsibility is being accountable for everything you own and everything in between. That's it for today. See you next time on Stone Mountain News. Bésame, que quiero sentir. Too came with that game, chop a rain, get a up boom. Shine when I walk through. Yeah, she found it. Who brought you? When I walk through, when I walk through, when I walk through, when I walk through. Sauce too came with that game, chop a rain, get a up boom shot. When I walk through, yeah, she found it. Who brought you? It's not great. Flag of Ethiopia. Okay, Ethiopia is how many colors in the country? The flag of Ethiopia? Three. Three. Red, yellow, and the green. Red, yellow, and the green. So, in this case, green represents what? Fertile land and farming, right? Green represents fertile land and farming. What about yellow? Okay, what about red? Yes, that's very important. Why? Because there is a slavery in my country. Let me explain to you. There is a big slavery in my country. The only Ethiopia is in the Africa never colonized it fight against slavery. Then, when our people they take from Africa to America, only country they fight against against slavery is what Ethiopia. That's the only one. She fights with Italy, with London, with Britain, with France, with everybody. Then we are proud of that. That's why everybody say red. Red means what? Blood. blood. So the country built by blood and protected by slavery by what? By blood. By blood. Okay. Again, what Ethiopia? Ethiopia is the country located where? In northeast of Africa. Ethiopia is the country located where? Northeast of Africa, right? What's North Africa? You know that, Northeast, right? Okay. Okay, northeast of Africa. Then the yellow, the Ethiopian flag is a mixture of green, yellow, and red. Green means fertile land and farming. Yellow means peace, love among the people. Red means the country is built by blood and protected by slavery by what? Blood. By blood. So people are very, very proud about the red, which means because they are protecting themselves and the, the people by Plus, that's why everybody likes this, so we're in red. <laughs> Okay, good. And this one is Dev Ngera. You know Ngera? Ngera. Yes, Ngera. This is Ngera, a picture of Dev and uh, another serial. Oh, serial? Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. And this one is. This one is the goat meat. Goat meat? Goat meat, yeah. The funny thing is, we also enjoy goat meat in Jamaica, but it's more. Um, we have two main types. It's usually curry or brown stew. Not cook like that, but you need to tell me the ingredients. The goat meat. The goat meat is 
what me in Berbere means that is hot, like uh, spicy, oh, that's us. spicy, okay. and the garlic, cool. and onion, and the tomato, potato, a mixture of everything. So okay. that's healthy. Okay. This one is uh, different cereals and veggie, yes. different veggie, the same thing. And this one is also hot sauce. Hot sauce. Yes. 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 This one is also uh, the same thing like that. Mm. So, um, so like he said, um, only goats, lambs, beef, and chicken are eaten as meat. It used to be one country, now Eritrea is its own um, country. And that little teeny one there that we spoke about? Djibouti. Djibouti? Yes. yes. Okay. Okay. Another thing about Ethiopian and Eritrean is people are light skinned because they are a mixture of Arabic. They can immigrate from uh, Middle East and the Africans. So when they mix it, they are light skin. So they call Abessina. Abessina. The race of the Japanese call it Abessina, which means Arabic and black. Okay. So, Saban. Let's go, Pirates! All the way to the line. Turn it up, turn it up. Oh, yeah. Woo! Great job. Away, let's go. Finish strong. Come on. Come on, there you go. Turn it up. Turn it up. Woo! Let's go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes.